Shout. You can't hear it. Shout. Shout. Is that what it is? <laughs> it is, yeah. It should be uh, Naughty or Nice. What's that song with Santa Claus is coming to town? Yeah. He's checking alert. Making a exactly. Naughty. We're doing Naughty Chicken today. It smells so good in here. <laughs> what are you doing? I mean, this pan looks gorgeous. You know, we took some wonderful uh, wild mushroom and sage olive oil, and I sauteed a uh, half a clove of garlic, so I've got a, a half a bulb of garlic, so I've got like seven cloves in there. Yeah. And then we put some green and gold peppers in there because the Packers are going to get another victory. Then during the during that little tease, I threw in a stick of butter, mm -hmm. a whole stick of butter, some beautiful, a sprig of rosemary. Which is just... Oh. Uh, <laughs> It, it smells so good. You know, I think I could take it out at this particular point. We'd have enough rosemary smell. You know sure. what I'm saying? But right now we're going to take a little bit of balsamic vinegar, a little organic balsamic vinegar. And this happens to be a little fat Louise. And we're going to do the naughty part. We're going to do a little bit of uh, Chaos Red okay. from Door Peninsula Winery. So we're going to do about a, a quarter cup of Chaos Red. Oh, let's make it a half cup of And Chaos the Red. smells just keep getting Ooh. better and better. And just a little bit of our number one barbecue sauce just to make it a little bit richer. Okay. And we're just, gonna, just like come up with this stuff? You know something, I'm, I was thinking to myself, I want to do something with, with golden plum chicken. I got some golden plum chicken breast there. So we're going to do a, uh, the saute. We're going to do, do more of a poaching. Okay. But the, the fumes, I'm going to cover this at the end. And, and our good friends, and I see them advertised here all the time, at Country Ovens. Uh -huh. uh, uh, so we have some dried cherries. Mm. So we have Cherry Delight dried cherries, and we're going to add those to the top. Now I've already oiled and seasoned the chicken breast, mm -hmm. and uh, those are those are those are nice chicken breasts. Did you use your seasonal? We used our seasonal, and we used a little bit of Grilling Magic, and we oiled them also. So that's going to be the oiling part. It's going to add to it. So we're going to place these beautiful, nice chicken breasts in our naughty recipe, mm -hmm. and I'm going to cover that so that it's kind of like the Schmucker's recipe. When you cover something, it, 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 it holds in all the flavor. Sure. So that's exactly what we're going to do is we're going to cover this. We're going to let it simmer for about 35, 40 minutes. And, 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 then, and then I'm going to reduce the sauce. When, when Doug comes over, I'm going to reduce that sauce and we're going to ladle it all over the top of that chicken breast. Okay, I think you have a winner here. I think we have you a winner. You guys always do, but that, I think it's going to be I awesome. I think it's going to be absolutely delicious. The flavors that are coming from right, right now are going to be fantastic. Yeah. They're going to infuse, and I'm not a chef, infuse into the chicken breast. So they're going to be delicious. Thank hey, you. Hey, catch us at Cook's Corner all week long, Monday through Tuesday, Wednesday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. We're going to be at Cook's Corner. they got all our supplies there. They have to do a lot of stores for holiday guests. Absolutely. Yep. Thanks so much. Hey, Thank you. Make sure you take a look at your screen, too because you can watch Mad Dog and Merrill on their Midwest Grilling Show on CW14 today. We'll be right back. You're watching Good Day Wisconsin.